welcome to Vlogmas Day 19. This is take four because Annie's on one. She is hungry, but she doesn't want any of the food that I put out for her. She wants snacks. You can hear her scrabbling in the background there because she wants to also play ball. <laughs> apparently it's landed in one of my Ugg boots. So apparently... <laughs> Apparently we're throwing my Ugg boot around. Jesus. What have you done? Thanks, honey. Only brand new. Give. Why? The ball's not in there. Oh, no, it is. Hang on. You've jammed that right in, haven't you? Oh my god. I must have bounced into my boot. Little sod. I can't be mad at her. She's too funny. <laughs> oh dear. So, um, oh, I don't know what I've said in the other takes. Sorry yesterday's was so slow. So short. We're just going to have to do this. Otherwise we're not going to get anything done today. Uh, yeah, sorry yesterday's was so short. I did a whole day at work. Um, it tires me out now in my current... Oh, she's being a little sob. Uh, in my current situation, I'm getting tired very quickly, as I'm sure we've covered. Um, so doing a full day is just... Oh, I was sat here, asleep in, on and off. I had to restart my programme four times. I had to rewind four times because I was... So bad. Oh, she is being a pickle. Never work with children and animals. Who'd like to see some yarn? Oh, number 19. Did I say 19 today? Did we get it right today? Oh, that's pretty. I like that. I'm liking greys more and more lately. Jess at Scale and the Stitch last year did a, she did a yellow, um, oh, I'll come back out of the camera, sorry. Um, she did a yellow and grey, and I'm not normally into yellow. Oh, hang on. She, she found it a ball band and decided to shred that. Anyway. This is... <coughs> Little Mermaid. We know Little Mermaid, and I think I'm getting a delivery now. This is awesome telly. I'm so sorry. Oh dear, what a day. <laughs> this is how my day is going to go, clearly. Let's just go with it. Just go with it. So, Little Mermaid. I really love this. This isn't something I don't think I would normally pick out, although I do quite like the sort of dirgy, moody colours. Dirgy is a disparative word, isn't it? But I don't mean that because I like them. Wow, so we've got some greys, some peaches, some... Like a beigey biscuity colour. Really, really like that. Oh, some green, I think. I need more of that. I'm going to have to see if she's uh, doing any more of that. <laughs> uh, in the pile. Awesome. Right, today. Well, today hasn't gone to plan already. I was going to get up, go and fill up the van um, so that I wouldn't get caught out over winter a uh, tank of diesel generally lasts me a couple of months because I don't do that much driving um, and then it means I'm good for a couple of months because um, I'm down to a quarter I don't like to go below a quarter it's kind of a thing from my dad he used to tell me off if I go below a quarter because you know in the sort of <clears throat> 80s and 90s if you go below that then you're pulling up all the dirge out of the the bottom of the tank um so that's not happening today i was going to go because it's next to a sainsbury's big supermarket i was going to run in there and get some more things for my dad's christmas stockingy thing that i'm doing that's also not going to happen because it's now half past 11 20 to 12 and the shops are going to be mental so i need to get there early um i have a big thing 
big aversion to crowds uh, and this time of year is mm. <laughs> so uh, I think I'm probably meeting dad for lunch again tomorrow I haven't spoken to him yet but I probably am and uh, come up then if you come in uh, so I think that means I'll get up early do my thing I want to switch my soda stream bottle out I did my hair today I had a little go with um, the shampoo bar that I made for my husband so I don't know if I said the other day on Sunday I had a really good get stuff done day I made some hand soap for myself some shampoo for the husband he likes a shampoo bar I use a special a special shampoo that thickens my hair and it works really well and I only I try to only wash my hair once a week but I wanted to see what his was like and it feels nice I only put a little bit in um, because I didn't want the thickening from my shampoo to completely leave and the more product I put into my hair the greasier it looks so I try not to do too much to my hair um, in terms of styling It'll be gone by the end of the day. Um, cut his hair on that day, on the Sunday. So yeah, had a good day on that day. Rambling now. Um, so that's not going to happen. So today I am going to do the product shots for my Santa's booties, which I've left upstairs. I'll show you later. Um, because they're also a gift. And I want to get them in the post... I can get raw mail to collect from here so if I do the parceling and stuff today online I can get them to collect tomorrow and then the person it's going to is going to be away for actual Christmas so it'll either get to them before they go or after they get back either way they're warm and they'll be appreciated um, the blue ones with the cables down the sides they've been gifted already because they were for my uncle and it was his birthday on Saturday he was 75 I can't make the drive to and from Birmingham from here um, without needing a serious nap <sighs> she's being naughty again what is it why do you hate me today <laughs> Oh, the face is so adorable. No, that, you'll find that's my box and not your toy. Okay? Mm-hmm. Clear? As mud. Uh, yeah, so I sent him some homemade socks. Um, and he already said to me... No. No, I'm talking. I'm, I'm talking. No. no. So he already said to me, I don't know how I'm supposed to get my shoes on over these. You're not supposed to. They're house socks to keep your feet warm. <laughs> Bless him. Okay. And, oh yes, I was going to show you. I was going to show you. I started another hat. And this this drops Aaron. Find a ball band that Annie hasn't eaten. Drops Nepal. It's not quite as thick as that um, patterns Aaron yarn. Um... It is, where's the list? Wool and alpaca for everybody, apparently. What's the... 65% wool, 35% alpaca. So, as we know, alpaca is about three times as warm as wool. So it's going to be insanely warm. But I've done this in the green. Oh, coming out. There you go. And I've done it without the folded brim this time. Um, which means I don't have as far to knit so with, with a folded brim you go to 11 and a half inches without the folded brim you go to about 9 I think it said and I think I'm almost at 6 so I'm nearly there so that's what's going to happen today I'm also going to do some of my hand spun jumper come on up then Uh, and also in that Aran yarn I still have white and red and black. Are you going to tell... Ow. And maroon. Are you going to tell everybody what an arsehole you are? Are you? Yes, I said that. What of it? 
I don't know. So yeah, I'm going to crack on. And hopefully she'll shut up and lie down. Oh, she spotted her. She spotted her stocking, which has got a toy sticking out of it. No, you're not getting it till Monday. No. If I don't go mad and get carted off to the funny farm, I'll see you later. Hello. It is now six o'clock and I started knitting at about one o'clock and it's all finished. Yay! I've sewn on a pom-pom but I've done it with a button because this is going to go to my uncle. He likes green and I've put one of my tags on. I'm not going to block it because I want to get it off in the post tomorrow. Um, <laughs> I'm going to do a Ravelry page for it because without the brim this is what I've got left out of two 50 gram balls this is 21 grams so 80 grams essentially but yeah I like it and wait perfect for humongous heads look at that uh -huh. yeah Maybe a bit shorter for my head. And I do have a massive head for a girl. That's probably annoying. I probably don't care. <laughs> yeah, that came out really well. The yarn is, it seems to be a lot softer than the patterns. Uh, Aran yarn, wool, wool yarn. Um, the hat isn't as stiff as that purple one that I just did and uh, yeah so that's a nice quick knit so sorry he's messing about in the kitchen um, uh, yeah we just went to Asda to get some food he got this lovely what looked like a lovely Korean beef meal and it was kind of like you know the Korean style taco sandwiches look great on the cover and no bread in it so we've got this beef stuff and nothing else nothing to eat it from so I guess we'll have to make some rice or something or or use actual tacos I've got some of those loose fillable tacos still honestly never mind right so I can get my parcel ready with my socks for Auntie Sylph, my hat for Uncle Dave. And we're all good. Now I'm going to start another one because I've got a lot of this yarn and a lot of time. And uh, yeah, I think my brother in law could do with one. He loves knitwear, absolutely loves knitwear. He bought himself um, and my, my sister, his girlfriend. <laughs> His, my sister, these hats with giant pom-poms on, a bit like the one that I made. Where is it now? Because the hat that I'm blocking actually hasn't finished. But look at the size of that bad boy. Um, Yeah, so he bought hats with giant pom-poms on um, and then asked me to make him scarves to match all of his hats. So I know he's knitworthy, I know his mum knits, so that's probably why... Um, I don't see my sister in anything I've made her on. Or maybe a scarf I've seen her in. But yeah, so that'll do him. Because he wanted a book, an expensive book, birthday and Christmas combined present. So um, let's do my hat as well, because I can. I love this. I'm so in love with this. <laughs> we'll do some advents in a bit. To, uh, I'll sign off now um, tomorrow we are going to attempt the um, petrol and the Sainsbury's trip uh, actually I might not need to go to Sainsbury's now because I managed to Amazon most things that I need so might just pop out for diesel which isn't interesting to you is it let's face it 
<laughs> I hate doing it, so why would you be interested? Um, yeah, so I'll catch you tomorrow.